Yo, hello everyone. Let's make a short tutorial about how to align, how to how to stitch a set of um, scans into a single one uh, using Photoshop. There are a lot of techniques of stitching images. I'm going to use this one. So, there are three steps. First, we go to strip, scri scripts and hit load files into stack. Here we're going to browse for our files and I'm going to use Andrew for raw files and I'm going to hit OK. OK again. And now all your files are going to be open as layers into a bigger document. So, in the end, when all files are going to be open as layers, we're going to come on. We're going to be huge. This one. We're going to select all of them, all layers, and go to Edit and Auto Align Layers. Here, we're going to select the reposition and just hit OK. Mm, this is going to be be pretty huge and. Uh, it's going to take a while to align all those selected layers. It's something like 30,000 pixels per 10,000 pixels, some sort of that file. These are going to be the, the we didn't hide. It went out fine. Now let's have a look. We can see here the, uh, the differences. We can st see the stitches okay and we don't like that so keeping all those layers selected we're going to edit and hit auto blend layers let's check seamless stones and colors and let's check panorama here anything else should not be checked we hit ok and we wait for the blending which is going to take a while also because the file is super huge and uh, That's pretty heavy computing. Okay. Oh, come on. It's going to take a while, as I told you. And uh, I'm not going to edit this tutorial. I'm not going to speed it up. So I hope you are going to wait with me during the video. It's almost there. Come on, come on, come on. Let's first hit this button and let's just flatten, not this one, layers. Flatten image. Okay. Let's now rotate it. And let's let's scale it down a bit, like, I don't know, 4,000 per width I just don't need that much so many pixels for this example let's crop it around the edges okay let's hit okay uh, let's crop it a little crop it a little bit more like that and yeah we have a nice stitched scan looks good to my eye uh, of course, from this point, it can be edited or whatever. Uh, I think a little bit more flatness would be required for this film, for this frame. Here I can see a slight curvature, and it's probably due to sandwiching or film holder. Here is more straight, so there's a problem on the, on the right side. Anyway, this is how you do it use the scripts you're loading your files into stack then you're going to auto align layers then auto blend layers and this is it this is how you're going to stitch your scans bye